melon is a large fruit of a more or less spherical shape. It is usually eaten raw. It has a sweet reddish or yellowish flesh. It contains potassium, magnesium, vitamin A, B1, B5, B6, and C. If you want to get a perfect watermelon, not this. Number one, find a few spots. When you get a watermelon, turn it upside down. There is a place that is not greenish in color. It may be whitish or yellowish in color. When it is whitish in color, it means that the watermelon was collected too soon and is not ripe, meaning that it will be tasteless. But when it is yellowish in color, it means that it is perfect and ripe, so it will be very sweet. So why choosing a watermelon? Choose the one that has yellow spots. Number two, get the heaviest one for its size. Sweet watermelon should feel heavy for its size, no matter how big or small it is. So why choosing a watermelon? Go for the one that feel the heaviest for its size. Number three, slap the watermelon. Another way to know if a watermelon is ripe is by slapping the watermelon. If the sound that comes out of that watermelon is deep, it means that it is ripe. But when the sound coming out of watermelon is flat, it means that it's overripe and may spoil before you get home. And if the watermelon is soft, it means that the watermelon has spoiled. So don't buy soft watermelon. Number four, look for the sugar spots and pollination points. If you see brown spots on the melon, this is where sugar is seeping out and it decays a sweet melon. Also, if you see dots in a line, not a scratch these are pollination points and the more of them the better therefore why choosing a perfect watermelon check the sugar points before choosing it so that you will buy a perfect watermelon five check for a uniform shape watermelon are round oval and either fine but if there are irregular bumps this indicates the melon may have gotten inconsistent amount of sunlight or water so don't buy it it will not be sweet number six check the tail a green stem usually indicates that the watermelon was harvested too early and will not be ripe but a dry stem usually indicates a sweet watermelon so why buying a watermelon check the one that has a dry stem number seven pick up your watermelon and sniff it if the watermelon smells slightly sweet say something similar to melon it will be sweet but when it smells raw, don't buy it. It will be tasteless. I hope you enjoyed my video. Subscribe and leave your comments. Thank you.